John Barry's Songs and Stories for Kids with Papa Bear. Thank you for allowing us into your home today to share these great stories with you and your family. Please take a moment to share this with your friends on Facebook. Also, if you all happen to take any photos of your family enjoying and following along, we'd love to share them. Please send them to us on the John Barry Music Facebook page. Now, without further ado, here's Papa Bear. Hey, little cubs, it's Papa Bear. It's so nice to be with you today. I have really, really been looking forward to our time together. I hope you've had a great week since I was last with you. Today, I want to introduce you to our little fur buddies. This little one right here is Bella. She's my grand dog. Bella is a Japanese chin Yorkie, and she is eight years old. And Bentley, our big golden doodle right here, He's a black golden doodle. He's seven years old. They love to play outside and go for long walks in the park. They especially love their toys. You all love your toys? I know you do. Oh, yeah, I know you do. <laughs> well, I tell you what. Have you remembered to wash your hands this week? It's really important to have clean hands. And to make sure I have clean hands and I've scrubbed them long enough, I sing the happy birthday song when I do it. Let's try it together, okay? Here we go. So, warm water, some soap. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, everybody. I just got soap everywhere. Happy birthday to you. And dry them, get some, rinse them off in warm water and dry them off real good. Well, you know, Things are still a little bit different than usual. It's almost like summer came early this year. But we get to spend a lot of good time with our families and maybe get to do some things we don't always get to do. It's a great time to learn maybe some board games or card games, or maybe you can learn to play an instrument like the guitar or maybe a piano. It's also a great time to read books. And today we're going to read a story titled The Three Billy Goats Gruff. This story is a Norwegian fairy tale and it first was first published back in 1843. That's a long time ago. I love this story. My mom and dad read this story to me when I was your age and I read it to my kids too. Everyone ready? We're going to read The Three Billy Goats Gruff. Here we go. Once upon a time, there were three billy goats. And the name of all three billy goats was Gruff. The billy goats lived in a valley where there was very little grass, and they were very hungry. They wanted to go up on the hillside to a meadow of green grass and daisies, where they could eat and eat and eat and get fat. But on the way up, there was a bridge over the river. And under the bridge lived a, mean, lived a mean and ugly troll. First, the youngest billy goat gruff decided to cross the bridge. Trip trap, trip trap went the bridge. Who's that tripping over my bridge? roared the troll. Oh, he's scary. Oh, it's only the tiniest, tiniest little billy goat said the first billy goat gruff in a very small voice. I'm on my way up to the hillside to make myself big and fat. No, you're not, said the troll. For now, I'm going to gobble you up. Oh, no, please don't eat me. I'm too little. Wait for the second billy goat gruff. He's much bigger. Well, then, go ahead, said the troll. After a while, the second billy goat gruff came to cross the bridge. Trip, trap, trip, trap, trip, trap went the bridge. Who's that tripping over my bridge? roared the troll. Oh, he's scary looking up over that. I'm the second billy goat gruff, and I'm on my way up the hillside to make myself big and fat, said the billy goat. And his voice was not so small. No, you're not, said the troll, for now I'm going to gobble you up. 
Oh, no, please don't eat me. Wait for the third billy goat. He's much, much bigger. Well, then, go ahead, said the troll. And by now, he was very hungry. He's also very scary. And just then, up came the third billy goat gruff. Trip, trap, trip, trap, trip, trap, went the bridge. The third billy goat was so heavy, the bridge groaned and creaked under him. Who's that tramping across my bridge, roared the troll. It is I, the third billy goat gruff, cried the billy goat, and his voice was a big and loud as the trolls. At last, said the troll, now I'm coming to gobble you up. Well, come along, cried the third billy goat gruff. I've got two big horns and four hard hooves, and I'm not afraid of you. So up climbed the mean, ugly troll, and the big billy goat butted him with his horns and stomped on him with his hooves and tossed him off the bridge into the river below. Then he went up the hillside to join his brothers. In the meadow, the billy goats got so fat they were hardly able to walk home again. In fact, they are probably still there. So snip, snap, snout, this tale's told out. The end. That is such a great story. The moral of that story is to always be kind to others. Hey, thank you for sending in pictures of y'all watching songs and stories for kids. And we have a winner of the signed poster of Pete the Cat from last week. And the winner is Anna. Yay, Anna. Hey, are y'all ready to sing a song? Come on, let's... Uh... Let's sing this song right here. Standing at the altar with family and friends Asking for God's blessing on this new life we
All right. Good deal. That's awesome. Hey, listen, thank you so much for being with us today. I look forward to being with you next week for Songs and Stories for Kids. Have a great day. In the field, on the farm, or in the saddle, we're right there with you in your pocket, on your phone, and everywhere you go. RFD TV Now, current ag reports, geo-targeted weather, live streaming 24-7, and our full collection of shows you love at the tip of your finger. At less than $10 a month, it's the cheapest tool on the farm. Download the app today and start watching RFD TV Now.